Hello, hello, hello. Peace, love, light, and protection to you guys. Let's hop straight into this message. Get ready, get ready, get ready. Because when I say that these people that have been operating out of these devilish energies, these demon-like energies, and they thought that slandering you and gossiping about you was actually going to bring upon your downfall, these people are being forced to think about you. The karma is about to be so extra on these people. And for ones who have been throwing stones and hiding their hands, they are no longer going to be able to hide how they feel about you. People who really, really envy you, they really about to let it be known. Because we're in the age of truth, the age of Aquarius. People, The truth has to come out about everything. Everything. So get ready. Okay? Because some of these people really feel some type of way. They've been forced to think about you, everything they did to you. People probably having dreams about you right now, not knowing what you know, wanting to know who you are. <laughs> Especially if you're very intuitive. These people are afraid of you and whatever protects you. So between now and within the next year, you're going to have a lot of people express how they really feel about you. Don't ignore it. Of course, ignore it, ignore it, ignore it, ignore it. You already knew this. It was no surprise to you. You seen it coming. You just had to walk away and really be stern and not going back towards these people. These people like really like these. These are like some people who like actually probably celebrated you at one point in time. The whole time they're a hidden enemy. How do you keep going? Generational wealth, kind. Hmm. But let's see what's going on with the energy here. That's why I've been saying on spiders. Because that the eight backfiring snakes, people hiding their hand, like actually being a spider. Webbing all type of things from hometown gossip to work gossip. It's just like a whole big web having their hands in many places to make sure that if you was to get outside the box they put you in, then when you go over here, you will still be trapped. When you go over there, you will still be trapped. But none of it was actually hitting you. It only seemed like it was hitting you. It was hitting you to grow, to, for you to grow, but it wasn't hitting you to harm you. It was hitting you to, to toughen you up for the battles ahead. Now, some of these people are like past like enemies. Like, look at that enemy showing his face again. <laughs> Let's see what's going on with the energy. Let me stop babbling off at the mouth. Let's see what's going on. What you want the collect to know when it comes to this current energy here, spirit? Important messages. We got independent. So you are an independent man, independent woman. You don't need to follow behind nobody. You march to the beat of your own drum. You're a leader. You know who you are. You could be an Aries here. You don't have to be. But something about your first house is important. First house is the house of self, how we brew ourselves, how we love ourselves. And I'm hearing spirits say you won. You won some type of battle here that somebody put you. Look at that backfire at the bottom of the deck. Something has backfired on someone here. Something backfired. That energy of the eight. That eight. Backfiring. What goes around comes back around. Knock me down nine times, but I get up ten. You had a lot of people trying to knock you down because they, they sense this independent energy within you. But they never wanted you to come to the realization that you never needed their validation. You never needed them to confirm anything for you. Everything that you needed was already within you because you were not your born leader here. On a different type of level, though. I feel like everybody are naturally born leaders in some type of way. But not everybody is meant to be a leader over a multitude of people. That's how I, I feel like this type of leader you are. You meant to be a leader over a multitude of people. And it's because you have good intentions here too. Let's get some more here. What's the energy? We got abuse. I'm also getting something about somebody's uncle here. Something about an uncle. An evil ass uncle for some of you. I don't know what that's about. We got a breeze coming out here. I'm going to take it up, right? But someone like could be like denying that they abused you or something. Or you're no longer affected by the abuse that happened to you. 
but somebody may feel like you are. You're literally not paying no attention to your haters here. And I might, like, if you feel like a tax anxiety in your body, you might be thinking about certain situations from the past. That's these attacks. People are still trying to attack you. They're still trying. Because they don't, they don't know no other way. Because some of these people literally conjured up demons here to attack you. And if the energy not going to you, then it's going to come back to them. But they live under an illusion here that it's not going to come back to them if they keep doing it. But they sadly mistaken here. We got protection. You are our, you are a one protected leader. And you I feel like you realize from birth that you are not like a, a lot of other people around you. And not, a lot of other people in the world here too. Not just your family and friends. Just a lot of people. A lot of people. You definitely felt like that eyeball out. You could have grew up being very silent here. Think that you need me. These people want you to think that you need them. They want you to think that you need their validation. So every time you could have used to came to people with good ideas that you had, or just you just needed love, you needed someone to actually care. But all they did was invalidate you. All they did was bring you down. The goal for them was to bring you down. And this is not everybody in your family, not all of your friends. These are just people here who are like mission to harm you, sent here to harm you, conjured up, talk to be a part of a coven to harm you. Let me get one more here. We got gifts. I wanted to abuse your gifts, abuse you so you won't see how gifted you are. Use them for your gifts. Use them for your support system instead of God. But they despise you. Give me some energy on these people here. Oh, look at the Aries. I just seen Aries. Yeah, somebody could definitely be Aries here. What about these people I'm picking up on, my collective enemies? Look at that. I see you. You see straight through these people. I feel like you always have. But now it's coming more apparent that you've seen straight through them. What about these people am I picking up on? People are person. This could be one of the multiple people for y'all. I want you to come and say something to me. They want you to communicate with them so they can try to have a way back in. But you're too protected. You see this person. You see this person. You work way too hard to get to where you are right now on your healing journey and moving forward in your life in a positive way to double back. Especially double back in with an enemy that's, that's secretly harming you. Give me two more on these people. Keep it pushing. Silence. So they... they Throwing stones and hiding their hand, bully. Throwing stones and hiding their hand silently. Oh, you think? Oh, you think? Um, you gonna get somewhere? You gonna go somewhere? No, no. I'm gonna go behind the scenes and silently do something to knock you down a, a notch more. Since you think you big and bad, every time I throw something away, you think you can just go somewhere, going going silent mode, protect yourself, and oh, go speak to God and everything. Oh, so 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 you you stronger now. You can get back up now. Silently throwing stones and hiding their hand. They're not going to be able to silently hide their hand no more because they know what's about to happen. Let's get one more. Yeah, I just think it's okay. What did you learn? They lied on you. Weird. Making it seem like you was the weirdo when they was actually the weirdo. These weirdo haters is about to be exposed. They can't hide in secret no more. So that's why I seen that silent. They trying to hide. Uh-uh, ain't no hiding, babe. Ain't no hiding. What? Crap about this independent leader here. 35. You can be saying 35. I've been saying a lot of 35s. Again, that eight. That eight, what goes around comes back around. And we got to show gratitude. You thankful for these leadership abilities that you have. You thankful that you have the ability to lead your own way here. So, of course, you're going to, you know, genuinely want to help other people. Clarify, knock me down nine times, but I get up ten. Look at that selfish. Obsessed with bringing you down. These people were selfishly obsessed with bringing you down. And they thought that this wasn't going to backfire on them. <laughs> Clarify, Bruce. I don't want to spend too much time on this deck, y'all. I want to get to the other deck, but I just want to pull some from here first. We got humble. They wanted to, they people wanted to humble you when you already had a humble spirit. They wanted to humble you more. 
And I feel, I feel like it's, it's through word of mouth, through validation. You someone here who like really felt like you needed other people's validation, but you didn't need their validation. You just, you really needed love, genuine love and support around you. But you didn't get it in the beginning for a reason. It's a, it's a cold, harsh world out here, y'all. And spirit had to, had to prepare you for that. Spirit already knew what the devil was going to have conjured up for you. So God already put some extra plans in place. Clarify this protection. Look at that purpose. Second time I seen purpose. Something about purpose. Your purpose, what you're doing. You did the work. Family member, why can't you give up? This is an evil family member that's getting ready to experience a tower moment here with this tower. They're getting ready to experience a tower moment. And then weird came out too, <laughs> along with you had to do things on your own. So you definitely someone who could who could have had to grow up fast here. And why did you why did you have to grow up fast? Because people deliberately put you in that position. So you can so you can lean on to them for protection. But you did the work to protect yourself from somebody here, a weirdo in your family. Who really wants you to give up on yourself? There's too many cards though, so I don't, I don't want to take all those. So let me get one spirit. Clarify protection for me. One more time. I just want one card. Look at that petty. <laughs> petty. You're protecting yourself from all pettiness. I see 35 here again. Yeah, somebody's on their way to a lot of uh, fortune. The wheel is literally turning in your favor here. It goes around, comes back around. You about to be on top while these people about to see exactly what the bottom feel like. Okay, this is what they wanted you to be. They wanted you to be at the bottom. They wanted you crawling up in a corner somewhere. And this is exactly what they about to be. And they ain't got the strength to handle it. Clarify you need me. But they wanted to put you there. And they was happy to do it. They, was, they smiled. These people smiled at the fact that you needing their validation. And wanted to put you in situations where you need that validation if they felt like you was getting outside the box. Deliberately. These are some of the demonic um, ways of thinking. Slave mentality. Clarify gifts. You could be a Pisces. We got rebirth. You, uh, I feel like your real gifts here, you went through a regeneration stage with your gifts here. Yeah, it's like the more you was learning, I thought like you was slow. You was learning lessons here. That's the thing. You was actually learning lessons here. Whether they seen it or not, whether you seen it or not, you was actually learning lessons here. And I feel like God gave you a boost to your gifts so you can pinpoint people out. Like, like yeah, God raised your gifts here, your, um, your discernment. This is going to happen anyway as you got older. It was going to happen anyway. And I'm also hearing from birth you was gifted. From birth, you was gifted. Somebody could also like be trying to like rebirth your gifts into them. Clarify, I want you to come and say something to me. And this for these people. God sent you. They put these people want to work for God, but they want to work for God in a demonic way. They want to use God to actually spread devil-like things. Like most people do now. Clarify, I want you to come and say something to me. We got look at that insecure. Insecure with scammer. This person is so insecure in themselves, whoever this is, whoever they are, depending on, you know, your situation. Very insecure within themselves. And the fact that you are secure within you yourself, or you come off as being secure within yourself, they don't like that. They don't like that. Because where's where is my security and who I am? The first house. Remember the first house? Secure. It also goes back to childhood, childhood trauma. Somebody that they ain't trying to heal. Clarify silent. So all they do is look at that. I lied to you. You have I lied to you showing this face and they lied on you out here. This person lied to you and they lied on you. Clarify silent. You got trust issues. This person is insecure and they don't trust themselves. Yeah. Good thing you got away from this person. Your people, like I said. You cannot trust these people, but you already know that. 
It's like just uh, you you I feel like you have to sit quiet for a side for a second and actually let these people tell you exactly who they are. And I feel like that's exactly what you did. Something about S here too. Selfish, smile, silence, something about S. I don't know why. SOS. These people are gonna be asking for help, child. Clarify they lied on you. They made you cry. Yeah, definitely saying something about SOS. We got meditating right back to ICU. These people premeditatedly planned on how they was going to lie on you and slander your name. This is crazy, y'all. That's crazy. Let's get some more here. What else here for the collective spirit? When it comes to these enemies. Look at that purpose. We just seen purpose in my other day. Purpose, accelerate emotion, the eight again, crown chakra, seven with spiritual union. These people are thinking about a way. I know what I'm here to do is on purpose. These people are really trying to think about a way here to reverse this karma back to you or to either find a way to reconnect with you to put it back on you. But they are failing here. These people are regretting what they did because they failing. It's not working. It's not working. And it never worked the way they thought it was working. Let's get some more here. Give me some on these people, Spirit. I want three on them, and then I'm going to get three on you. Three on them, and then I'm going to get three on you. Guilt. <laughs> what do I say? I release any beliefs that no longer exist in my soul's growth. Ain't no time for growth now, buddy. <laughs> I think you need to go speak to God. <laughs> okay? That's what I think. There's something about the end for you. Celebrating too quick. But you and whoever else you was with, we got harmony with destiny coming out here together. So somebody, then I want you to be in balance with yourself. Yo, I thought this was a group of people. All taking part in trying to destroy your destiny, your purpose. This is all about your purpose. You knowing what you... These people know... From birth, what you was sitting here to do. These people know from birth that you was gifted. That's why rebirth and gift is out here. And that's why I know this is family. I'm going to keep this harmony and destiny together since they came out together. And get one more for them. Give me one more for these people. Imagination. I embrace and nourish the creative aspect of my mind. These people ain't got a creative bone in their body. But when they get around you, they feel creative here. Because you're the gifted one. But instead of them working with you, they worked against you. And spirit don't like that. Let's get three for you. What about my collective? We got truth. These people know that you see the truth about them. You see straight through their illusion here. And you standing in your truth. Standing your ground proudly. Not taking nobody bull crap. And once again, they regretting what they did. Movement, choice, and decisions. You made a, a very... Very, very good decision to walk away from people and go towards your destiny here. And to become one with yourself. And to get the things in life that you actually want, that you actually desire. You don't want the pettiness, the gossip. You don't, you don't want to be around energies and stuff like that. Let's get one more. Yeah, you changed. I just seen change. They don't like the fact that you're changing. Because they always knew you was different. They always knew you was going to change. But they wanted to be around you while you change so they can try to stop you or at least get a piece of it or try to like destiny swap. We got prosperity begins. See, you have the creative ability here to build something for yourself. They don't have that ability. But when they get around you, they feel like they do. You give these people hope because of your light, your gift. And it's a good thing because that can help people transform and change themselves. But it's not a good thing when people are trying to use you. Clarify this guilt. Look at that deception and envy. Because <clears throat> now these people are just a memory of love. We don't want nothing to do with them. Nothing to do with them. But you sending them love from afar. These people feel you sending them love. Feel you forgiving them from afar. They feel it. And it's eating them apart. Because they don't want you to forgive them. They want you to go back and forth with them. They want you to be to stoop down to their level. And you're just not going to do it. You're not going to do it. You see the truth in them. You see that they hurt. You see that they're insecure. You see they need to heal. So you're just going to send them along their way. 
with love. You don't want nothing bad to happen to these people. As a matter of fact, you might be praying for them. You know, you don't feel bad for it though. Because they did what they did. They made their own bed, so they got to lay in it. You don't feel bad. But that don't mean you want something bad to happen to them. <laughs> it's the difference. Clarify destiny with harmony. It's the difference. Two more cards came out together. Spiritual strength and suffering in silence. Nine, nine. Whoa. <laughs> what I say, they're going to have to have, they're going to have to find the strength. While they're in silent mode, they're going to have to find the strength here to rebuild themselves and to raise their ranking. And I don't feel they got the strength like you do. While you were suffering in silence, you had God lifting you up and you was trying here too. You was trying. I see base chakra here at the bottom of the deck with change. You was trying your best here to change your situation, to heal yourself, to heal your wounds, your childhood wounds. And so like, again, the first house, to heal how you feel about yourself, not needing nobody else's validation. Yeah, somebody did a lot of healing here. By moving on. Clarify this uh, imagination. Clarify imagination. Yeah, this is definitely a group of people. You got foundation achievements. They don't have the creative ability here to build. And this is literally building here. This is the four wands. Building a foundation. <laughs> but you do. You have the ability here to build a foundation. And they do too. I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna say it like that. They do too, but they don't know how to find it the way you do. Cause they insecure. They're not healing. They're not trying to move forward. They don't they, they don't get it. Clarify this truth. Oh, we got Dell. They came out in reverse though. I am learning that endings are merely beginnings. I feel like you done letting people hold you back and try to stop you. You done let you because you see the truth. You done pretend like you don't see people. What does death? Why did death come out in reverse? Peace. I just seen worry, and we got fertility here. The rejoicing celebration. Hashtag ignited change. <clears throat> this is the Empress card. It's fertility. I'm also seeing these people realizing that they cannot stop you. Cry about this movement, choices, and decisions. Movement, choices, and decisions. Rest and rejuvenate. Another four. Yeah, this is like you meditating, going into silent mode, speaking to God. What you should, what you should, what should, what should you do? Yeah, at moments when you were suffering in silence here, walking this path, just trying to find what you were sitting here to do. That's all. But you just didn't realize all the attacks that was happening around you. Clarify this prosperity begins. Emotional withdrawal. And we got temptation at the bottom of the deck. We're trapped in fear. These people are trapped in what they did to you. They're trapped. They feel it. Because they was too tempted to come for you. Look, oh my goodness, look at that. You see out here in the cell? And then right here is the key. These people are in spiritual prison. They're, they're in spiritual prison because they cannot control themselves. They couldn't heal. Something is backfiring. And it's to your family. Five and six. Six. That's family. People in your family here. That's what I'm getting with this temptation. Clarify this temptation. The people in your family regret, yo. I feel like it's just multiple people here. Too. Look at that worry. With six at the bottom of the deck again. Material and spiritual prosperity. These people's. Y'all don't know what they did. But it was definitely something. Clarify this temptation with worry. They definitely didn't do the right thing here. Look at that. Stop worrying. Root chakra. We were just talking about the root chakra. Trauma, fear, anger, happiness. We were just talking about the root chakra when I showed y'all that card. 
and we got to do the right thing. They had every opportunity to do the right thing here and not come for you. But they were just too tempted, too insecure, too jealous, too envious. And now they cannot stop worrying about what's going to happen to them for not doing the right thing. And these people knew that God sent you here with some type of special gift. And there's a mom here definitely involved. Dog breaker. I don't like you. Child. Brother. Give me one more here for this temptation. We worry. They go to lies. Lie. They saw a lot of lies about you. So these people that told a lot of lies about you, it's really going to be hitting them in their head. Look at that gossip. As I, as I stop shuffling the deck. You stand out. You stand out. Your presence is too strong for these people. They don't They don't like it. They, they, they just don't like it. They don't like it. And we got changes coming. I'm just talking about change. These people don't want you to change, though. They want you to stay in that box. Sending you the evil eye and stuff. Like, everything these people are not are doing, though, is no longer working. It's not working no more. Let's get some more hand clothes it out, though. Let's see. Let's get some clothes and not mess with this here, spirit. The moment you decided to walk away from people that you could clearly see and that your body is telling you are not for you, the moment it changed everything. And they have to sit in their energy because it goes back to them. Like you calling back your power here. Every day, make sure you call back your power. From anybody who has it, that tried to take it from you, your voice, your innocence, call it back. Let's see what else here is important for the collective spirit. Thank you. I kind of want to clarify some of these cards. We losing everything. Who are you? Do you see what I'm saying? These people are about to lose everything. Clarify we losing everything. Who are you? Like, I know you're a part of my family, supposedly, but who are you really? Deep down inside, on the soul level, who are you? You are somebody that's powerful as hell, baby. You powerful, and they feel it in your presence. You stand out. Don't give up. We planted something for you. Divine ancestors and angels. Whoa. So I want to say, while they losing, you gaining that eight. The will is turning in your favor. What goes around comes back around. But as they get what they deserve back to them, you're going to get what you deserve too. Depending on what you've been sending out versus what they've been sending out to the universe. Whether you want to call it the universe, God, or whoever. Whenever people think about gossiping about you and they think about doing harm to you, they send it out to something because it's a form of energy. Whatever what you think can literally manifest. That's why you have to be careful about what you think because it can manifest. What's this temptation here with worry? These people are batshit scared. Money. Because it's all about money, foundations. And approved. You've been approved for this. this whoa, wow, wow. Clarify this money. They wanted your money in some type of way. Whether using your energy, whether they around you to gain money. We got power couple. Well, wow, somebody about to be a part of a heavy, powerful power couple here. You're going to have a lot of people worry. You make me nervous at the bottom of the day. You're going to have a lot of people worry here. And they ain't going to be able to do a damn thing about it. What's this guilt here with memories of love? Family involved in a bad way. What did I say? This is definitely family here. Definitely family. And you are sending them along their way here, but with love. It's like, I can't, I, I, I ain't got no, I ain't, I, I, babe, I don't, you probably ain't even saying nothing. You probably ain't even saying nothing. You probably ain't even saying your piece to them or anything like that. You just simply moving on with your life. And just telling God, I choose to release this person with love. But I'm moving forward with my life. I'm telling you. What's the spiritual strength here with suffering and silence, destiny, and harmony? 
inheritance taken or about to be discovered. If you had an inheritance, if these people, if these people was holding back money from you because they didn't want to see you do good here in life, all oh, day about, and that's nothing I'm getting here with this foundation achievements. You probably have money, an inheritance sitting somewhere for you that these people have been holding on to, hoping for your demise so they can gain it. Oh, hell no. What's this inheritance? We got to get outside, have some fun. When you decided to focus on you, it changed everything. You could even have a couple in your family here trying to take something from you. Or even on mom and dad. They probably need to be real parents. I don't know. But spirits say get outside and have some fun here. Well, that's what these people need to do. <laughs> I don't know. What's this imagination with foundation achievements? They need your help. They need money from you. That's what it is. They need money from you. These people are going to need your assistance here. And again, what, I, what did I say? You have the creative ability here to build something. So when they get around you, they try to take your creative ideas, ask for your advice, don't never give you credit for anything. Mm -mm. What is fertility with death and truth? Oh, shit. Time to celebrate wanting to come out. Along with they wanted you sad, heartbroken, and not connected to God. They don't like that you are different and watch you online. These people are watching you online and they don't like your connection to God here. You don't care. You about to get ready to celebrate a lot. All because you stood up for yourself. There's too many cards though, so I don't want that many. <laughs> so we're gonna do it again. Give me one more hit spirit. I just want one card of. You don't give a damn what people think about you. All right. One card hit spirit. Fertility, truth, with death. Thank you. And it fell right on top of it. Losing their mind because you're doing well. <laughs> These people are losing their mind because you're doing so, so good. I say it's something about to take off of you. You see the truth between these people and they're losing their mind because they had you on some time. They thought they had you under an illusion. The whole time they was in, a, in an illusion of hurting you thinking that they, it was actually going to work. And they're having a hard time leaving that space. they literally losing their mind trying to get you to lose your mind. But you're not losing your mind. They are. <laughs> this is crazy, y'all. Clarify this movement, choice, and decision with rest and rejuvenate. You had to take it to God, and God just told you to walk away. Envy. Why you? Like, you ask God, why do these people envy you? Like, like why? You don't you don't understand why it seems like they feel some type of way about you. And Spirit just, just said, walk away. Clarify this envy. Why you? Spirit just said, walk away. Don't even worry about it. Split up for yourself and walk away. What did I say? Spirit just said, walk away. Don't even worry about it. Because these people spoke ill will over you and you had no idea. You didn't know the extent of what was actually going on with these people. I hope y'all can see that, child. Y'all probably couldn't even be seeing these cards the whole time. I was looking up at the camera. I just seen 333 on the uh, clock. Oh, these people want to speak to you because something is over. This cycle is over with. What did I just, what did I just say before this card came out? You ask God, why did it seem like people feel some type of way about you? And what did God say? Just stand up for yourself and walk away. See the truth that you that you do. Your, see the truth that you do feel. You do sense that there's something going on with these people, but don't deep, dig deep and try to figure out what it is. Just listen to what they're telling you. Listen to what your body's telling you, and just walk away. And that's what you did. Clarify this prosperity begins with emotional withdrawal. And therefore, babe. About to have a lot of things come, it, but it's time to celebrate, baby. It's time to clarify. It's time to celebrate. It's time to celebrate. Spirit says it's the only thing you should be worried about. It's time for you to celebrate, baby. So go have some fun, you know. Go on vacation. Do the big one with you and your kids, your husband, wife. We got secret admirers. Some of you have a secret admirer. Look at that nine eleven. Good news for you. There's some good news coming in for you. Mm-hmm. As you should, babe. Okay, I can't stop it there i gotta pull some from the tarot here too child y'all let me get a little bit from the tarot let's see what else is going on here spirit what else is important here for the collective i want
gonna care, care about this envy why you withstood it for yourself and walked away. Two cards. Cyber bully. You are being bullied online with justice. <laughs> These people are so mad watching you get justice from spirit. Oh my goodness. Look at that happiness hater. <laughs> yo. It's time to celebrate, yo. Clarify this cyber bully. It's time to celebrate, y'all. Justice. The skills have been balanced for you. It's been proven in the court of law that you deserve everything that's coming in for you. Clarify cyber bully. Look at that jackpot. These people thought they hit the jackpot. They also see that they see you that you about to get something here. Winning money, got rich, inheritance, unexpected money. Yeah, these people know that you about to receive something, yo. They know you about to receive something. That's why their money came out here. They know you finna get ready to celebrate. These people been knowing since birth that you was meant to do something real big. That's crazy, y'all. Give me some on these people. What about these people? Evil ass family members, bro. We got the chariot. They going to jail. What's the chariot? They about to get ready to get locked up. <laughs> locked up. They won't let me out. Because you got to think about what you did. Bad reputation. Oh, look at that. All the gossip. All the gossip is about to hit these people like a ton of bricks. ton of bricks. Now, you, you know people that love people validation. They ain't going to be able to handle it. They're not going to be able to handle it. They're going to they gonna be a hermit. They're going to be a sad hermit. They're going to really want to isolate themselves from people. Because even if it's not them being around people in a family with this bad reputation, it's going to happen with the friend, the friend groups when they go to work. It's going to happen in some way. They have to see what it feels like to have their name being tarnished like that for absolutely no reason. Clarify bad reputation for absolutely no reason. They didn't even have to take it that far. Threatened, intimidated, threatened, bothered. <laughs> they on guard. They on guard. Clarify losing their mind because you're doing well. Two of Pentacles. What goes around comes back around. These people are losing their mind because why are you doing good? Why are you doing good? You're not supposed to be doing good. You're not supposed to be happy. You're not supposed to be full of joy. Why? Oh, because the scales are being balanced. That's why. What's two of pentacles? What goes around comes back around. That's why. <laughs> love triangle. Third party, multiple lovers, choices. Yeah, this is a group of people here. I'm not getting no lover situation. I'm just seeing a group of people here. A group of people Thinking that they won something. Thinking that they had it together. But the magician. What's this love triangle? Kissing ass. They're going to they gonna come back, try to give you your flowers and kiss your behind here. Even if you did have a lover involved in this situation. <clears throat> they're going to go through the same thing. Clarify time to celebrate. We got the, it's time for you to celebrate because at one point in time, you couldn't celebrate because you was being so heavily attacked here. Just trying to figure out what was going on with you, baby. You got every reason to be smiling and celebrating right now because you. this is what you came out of. You came out of this torment. And you came out of it. What's this nine of swords? You deserve to be celebrated. We got rejected. Ah, another thing I'm seeing here is someone else is in this Nine of Swords energy here feeling rejected because they can't celebrate with you. I'm, a, I'm definitely seeing that with this too. Somebody want to celebrate with you literally right by your side. Yeah, there's an X here too. Yeah, into you. Mm-hmm. There's an X here. They really want to come back into your life, keep you stuck, waste your time. But see, you walk away. You're, you're not playing with people. You are not playing with people. I'm telling you. Clarify this jackpot. Let me get one more for that jackpot. Talking shit, man. Why they get to get this? What you mean? Why they get to have all this? Why they get to have that money? Why they get to... Uh, There's a whole bunch of why, 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 why. Talking nothing but cash money stuff about you, bro. I'm sorry. They was talking cash money. 
talk about his money here, as a matter of fact. What's this money? I'm going to get close it out, y'all. He got the Knight of Swords. Impulsive Actions. What's the Knight of Swords? Moving on. Thank you, next. Impulsive. They, they, they ain't no money. They gets no money. They gets no money. Clarify this guilt here. Rememories of love. And I'm going to close it out, y'all. Creeping. Clarify creeping. Now you got people secretly watching you, feeling guilty, wondering what you know here. I want you to get in some money. These people know you about to get paid here. Like, nah, man, you ain't, man, give us some of that money, yo. <laughs> man, don't even do us like that, Kim folks. Give us some of that money, man. We see you over there celebrating, having fun, cheers, making that money. Give us some. Clarify giving money. There's all these people wanting some freaking money. Not, but well, well, why try to tarnish someone, knowing that someone is destined for greatness? And when they get to that greatness, knowing you're going to want a piece of it, but they're all this to stop them from getting to that greatness. It don't make sense. Temperance. <laughs> Somebody's an earth angel here. Oh, this could be a Sagittarius. Clarify everybody's giving money with temperance? Let me get one more. With the six of swords, you move forward. An earth angel move forward and they ain't, you, these people ain't getting nothing. And th this is time for reflection. They're going to have to reflect on what they did here. These scarcity tactics, play, trying to play checkers, chess, whatever, to get back at somebody. Not even to get back at somebody, but just to stop somebody here from stepping into their power. From being who you meant to be. What? And now they holding a grudge here because they, they don't get a piece of what you got going on. Because they were doing counter math. They were doing everything that they could here for you not to get it. But now they want to fight, though. <laughs> These folks are crazy. These folks are crazy, y'all. I'm going to get one more from each deck, okay? Let's get one more here, Spirit, to close it out. Let's close it out here. One to close it out for my collective. We got solitude. These people, they, they, about, to go on, they about to go in silent mode. And see just how much, how thankful they really need to be uh, towards God here. These people are going to wish that they would have never did this. Clarify the solitude. It's giving they a hater. Somebody got to learn how just how much of a hater they actually are. They got to look back, back at what they did. Spirit got to sit these people down so they can look, at, look back at what they did to get them to where they are. What's this solitude? It's giving they a hater. Look at that, their turnout. Oh my goodness. Because you can finally see. <laughs> Yo, this is crazy, y'all. It's their turn to sit down and see why they are where they are right now. Gratitude. I am thankful for this life and the opportunities that it presents. You was presented as a gift to these people, but they couldn't see it because they was unhealed, being a hater, being insecure. There's all type of things here, but they have to sit down and see now because you stood your ground. You stood your ground, and now you about to have nothing but success, bro. Like, look at that. I can't make this up. This literally already came out here. Stood up for yourself and walked away, and you walked straight into success, baby. Can't make it up. These people can't mess with you. <laughs> But that's the mission I have for y'all collective. I really hope y'all guys enjoyed the video. See you in the next one.